Hey you all, it's your girl, the internet hall. And for today's video, mock curls, I know, I know, okay, I know. I know y'all missed it kasi ginutom ko kayo noong October with a haul. And yes, sinadya ko talaga yun kasi I was able to collect itong haul na to. This is my collection from August, September, October. Actually, kulang pa nga to eh kasi yung iba, inalagay ko na lang siya sa 12-12. But this... Bitch, I'm so proud of this haul because this is like the biggest haul I've ever had. We have affordable, we have high end, we have makeup, we have skincare, fragrance, self care. Like I swear, this is the biggest haul I've ever done. Yeah, honestly, if you're watching this vlog, wag na kayo mabubudos sa iba. Sa akin na lang. E ato kartyo na ngayon, just check out yun na lang sa 11:11. Sa akin na lang, because y'all know I don't miss babes. And also, you all know my recommendation, fucking life changing. Okay, like bitch, you're not gonna be the same person. Okay. And of course, small curls. In case you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe down below. Hit that bell notification. Icon so you're always notified. And lastly, make sure you follow my social media, Instagram, TikTok. If you want to be an it girl, bitch, follow me, babes, because I give the best advice. So without further ado, mock curls, let's get started. Alright, mock curls, I have all the products in front of me here. I love you, mock curls. Some products here if you watch my old hauls and also I'll be linking my haul videos sa baba if you guys want more recommendations if it's not here but mostly here are new it's called hot curl haul so you can click that below if you want to shop some more but in this haul I have many new products but some products talaga I just have to repeat again kasi sobrang ganda na parang like if you're new here you gotta buy it babes because it's fucking life changing alright so starting off let's do with skincare muna I want to start with this one this is an oldie but a goodie but it's always my staple that I got when it comes to skincare if only my job wasn't testing out other skincare or products, I would always go back to this. And as you can see, babes, pa obus tasha dai. Kasi I always use this. This is the Ponce H Miracle line. So this is more of anti aging. It has retinol. It has your niacinamide. Everything is here, ne? Completo na shop. Plus, on top of that, they have a skincare set which you can get the Ampule, which is also my favorite. They have the Ponce Ampule Serum, which is super nice and concentrated, filled with peptides. Tapos, this is my very favorite serum talaga sa kanila. Honestly, if you want to get something in this line, get this. This is the Pons H Miracle Ultimate Youth Essence. If you've been a long time viewer dito, I always have this with me and I always use this for the past, oh my gosh, three years na. They even have night cream and also day cream. Pero mostly I always use night cream. Ito talagang gamit ko. Tapos, they also have eye cream as well. This is so good talaga if you want to brighten your eyes. And also yung mga fine lines and yung malalim dito, it helps with that. And also mga girls, the reason why you want to check out sa 11.11 at the cart now, kasi pagdating sa 11.11 in Shopee and Lazada, Pons will be up to 50% off. And also, you can get free gifts as well. So, this is the perfect time for you to try the Pons H Miracle Ultimate Youth Essence if you want to give it a try, if you want to prevent aging, babes! 50% off, come on. Alam nyo, it take advantage yun na. Kaysa mag-botox kayo, napakamahal. Alright, Mocker, so moving on to the next skincare. Alam nyo, the theme of my skincare for this 11.11 is all about peptides, anti-aging, like yun nga, retinol. With the rise of retinol, and your favorite OG influencers are millennials, hence, since we are close to getting older. That's why I'm trying to prevent aging. Mostly, my products dito are focused on anti-aging. So, alam nyo, I'm 27 now, which it blows my mind. Like, I feel like yesterday I was 21. Yesterday, I was 28. You know what's so funny? When I was 21 back in the day, I look older. Pansin nyo din ba? I remember the old genre. I look fucking old. Even some people thought I work for the government. I'm like, what? What do you mean? Do I look like I'm old, babes? When I look back, at my old videos, I'm like, oh yeah, I kind of agree. Yeah, I look older. Now, I'm like 27, I look younger. What? That's weird. Okay, normally the products I am using lately are very peptide-focused. Trust me, I feel like with the popularity of retinol, and not everyone can use retinol. Yun nga, if you're 23 or if you're in your early 20s, that's the time you can use retinol. But if you're a teenager, oh, stay away from retinol. What I can advise for like teenager, go for peptides. Habang bata pa kayo, okay yung collagen nyo, before 25 years old, if you just want to prevent aging, Take care of your skin barrier using ceramides and peptides. Because peptides, it's more of like it's reversing ahead of time. You know what I mean? Retinol is like, for me, I see retinol as a chemical peel. Anyways, with that being said, I am very focused again with peptides. I found this skincare brand. This is not sponsored. I was like scrolling sa Shopee lang kasi. This is called MediPeel. That's the brand. They have here All-in-One Essence Peptide 9 Volume Essence. This has volophylline. Tapos 
the way you use this is ganito. I swear, Korean products is like innovative. Ganito siya. You pump it out like that. Lagi mo lang siya sa face mo, ganyan. Tapos spread mo lang siya. Tapos wait for a couple of minutes, magbabubble siya. Ayan, fast forward, magbabubble siya. Tapos you just pat it sa skin mo, ganyan. Sobra cool. I know, right? You just pat it on and then just massage it sa skin mo. Ganyan siya. It gives you the moisture that you need. If you're trying to prevent aging or if you have dry skin, oily skin, actually for all skin types, and if you just want to look younger and you want your skin to get plumper, get this. Oh my gosh. Sobra ganda. It's like Botox in a bottle. Tapos, nung binili ko to, I was able to try this since August pa. I got so interested. Bumili din ako ng serum nila. I actually bought this separately on different dates. Ito muna yung binili ko kasi I find it so interesting. And then I was like, you know what? Let's try their products. So, I tried their other products. Hindi ko nagustuhan yung sunscreen nila. It's too white. And some of the other products hindi ko na bet. But the serum, get this. This is their Volume Biotox Ampule. This is like their serum. If you're looking for anti-aging talaga, it has peptides din. Like, bitch. Kung gusto mo balat yung skin mo, get this. It's so good. All right, so moving on to the next skincare. Since we're in the topic of peptide, again, this is my third bottle. Just so you know, this is my third bottle. And this came out last year. This is Happy Skin's Bakuchiol Peptide Oil Drop Serum. This has Bakuchiol peptides and hyaluronic acid. When I tell you I sometimes use this underneath my makeup, my God. My skin is so glowing. So ganyan. It's an oil, yes. It's an oil. Pero it doesn't feel like an oil. It just feels like a serum. And basta, sobrang lambot ng skin ko neto. And it feels so plump. I use this in morning night. The best. I mean, I've been using this for almost a year now. And it's one of my favorite serums. Holy grails. I love it. And you see, this in my older hauls. For sure, nakita niyo na to. Alright, Malka. So, moving on to the next serum. One of my favorite discoveries pagdating sa skincare. This is the Causer X 6 Peptide Skin Booster. This has hyaluronic acid, NAG, amino acid. It has six kinds of peptides. And you know, I'm all about peptides lately. And let me tell you, bitch. This has 150 ml. Serum to, ha? I've been using this for so long, pero ganyan pa lang yung bawas niya. And to think, I use this for my skin prep. I use this sa gabi, skin prep, which is pag lumalabas ako. Dinala ko rin to sa Hong Kong. Nag-Hong Kong din kami. I bought this. Girl, sobrang tipid niya. If you're looking for a serum that has peptides and you're on a budget and you want that serum to last for so long, for how many months, get this. Kasi you get a lot. Tapos you don't even need a lot. It's a pump. You just do two pumps. Pat it on your face. Good skin. And then my God, let me tell you, if you put your makeup or if you just leave it on, it gives you the most plumpest skin, glass skin. Na parang, for me ha, my skin drinks this up. Like parang, you know what I mean? Like a plant. Para alam mo yung nadaligan yung plant. Nadiligan. Yes! Okay. Yeah, but like, if you think I'm a ito yon. I really love this one, talaga. Causer X, y'all did something with this one, okay? Alright, so moving on, my girls, I'll have a review of this soon because I was able to try this no October, two weeks. This is Skintific line. This is Skintific skincare. I'm pretty sure you've seen this on TikTok all the time. Actually, maganding skincare nila. The best way I can describe it, it's very basic. If you want something good for sensitive skin, the most basic skincare. Pero for me, ha, normally when you say basic, skincare. People are not enticed by it. They're like, oh, basic, baka wala effect, ganon. Ah, gusto ko na burn siya, ganon. I feel like tayo mga Pinoy, sanay tayo na parang very flowery words, and daming claims, like, oh, ganito, ganyan. Pero sometimes, it's basic skincare is what we need. Let's not complicate things, you know what I mean? Like, let's not stress the fuck out. Kasi, if you complicate your skincare, you're stressed out, tas yung stress, dun din nagre-reflect sa skin mo. So, you might as well keep it basic. That's what I like about this. Super friendly sa weather natin. This one time, no October, I believe, event the happy skin. Ito yung gamit kong skin prep. When my makeup artist was doing my makeup, I was like, yeah, use this one for my skin prep kasi I'm testing this out. Bitch, my skin looks so fucking good. So if you're looking for a sign to get skin to fix skincare kasi lagi nyo nakikita sa TikTok, get it. You have my go signal. Tapos also, they have the skin to fix SPF 50 PA++++. This is a sunscreen mist. So ganito siya. There's a full size and there's a travel size. I swear, ganyan siya. It's like that. Tapos you just set it with powder. This is the most convenient sunscreen ever if you're wearing makeup tapos gusto mo lang mag-retouch. I know. I did my research. Sunscreen mist is not the best. But let's be real. Like, let's be honest for a second, babes. Okay? Let's be fucking for real. Do you retouch your sunscreen every two hours? Who does that? Especially if you have makeup. Like, let's be real. I'll, I'll be fucking honest. Lately, I haven't been doing that and I don't even do that with my normal sunscreen. Imagine I put this and then what's the sunscreen ako on top of my makeup? Yeah, okay. This is not the best for sure. Okay, it's not the fucking best. Research shows like, oh, if you use mist, it's not the best for your skin. Dermatologists like, oh, I wouldn't recommend mist for sun. I get it. But honestly, let's be real. Is retouching sunscreen in the room with us right now? So, alam mo yun, para for me, ha, it's not like 
scientifically the best. Wala pa rin makatalo sa sunscreen na, let's say, pinapahid or two-finger method. Okay, wala pa rin makatalo nun. But yet, it's still something. Like, if you want to touch up your makeup and less hassle, it's still something. So, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be, like, dermatologists, like, you know, the skin enthusiasts gonna attack me. But again, let's be real. Do you have the time? Like, I'm in a fucking theme park. Can you catch me retouching my sunscreen on top of my makeup? No. I'm in a theme park. Leave me alone. This one has been super helpful. Dala namin to sa Hong Kong. Actually, when we went to Hong Kong, it's kind of gloomy. This is around like third week of October. Medyo gloomy. Pero, I still use sunscreen. Just keep it safe, babes. We're not getting any fucking younger. So, moving on. I told you more. Anti-aging tayo dito, mga bayon. I have here, this is an oldie but a goodie. This is Good Molecules Gentle Retinol Cream. I've been a user in for so long. This is one of my favorite retinols. As you can see, so sobrang matagal ko na siya gamit. Nabutas na yung dito day. Pero yeah, if you're looking for a good retinol, Sundays are my retinol days. So I usually put moisturizer, retinol, moisturizer. Guna lang ako. So I usually use Skintific or any moisturizer I have na thick. Then I'll use a retinol. This one never failed me. Matagal na to sa akin. And also I noticed ever since gumamit ako na retinol, how do I describe it? Mas smoother yung skin ko. You know like an egg? Pag nagbalat ka ng boiled egg, it's like that smooth. That's what my skin looks like. My under eye cream pag retinol day, I use this Lux Organics Retinol Bakuchiol. I fucking love this. Like I love na may applicator siya. So you just do that. Good ka na. Sobra ganda. So I usually use Use moisturizer retinol, tapos ano moisturizer. Final step to your eye cream. Moving on again to anti-aging na naman ba? I told you I'm taking anti-aging seriously, babes. Okay? Because I'm trying to save money, na hindi mag Botox. Because that shit is expensive and it's not permanent. Okay? So moving on, mga girls. If your problem is yung mga hollow under eyes, yung malalim yung under eyes, I have to bring this back because it's so more effective nito. The thing is, if you use this and you stop using it, babalik yung hollowness ng under eyes mo. Yun yun napansin ko. Because there was a time I recommend. And this is a vlog. Gamit ko siya na walang malalim na under eye ko. Ito. This is the Lumi Volufilin na serum. This is known for adding volume sa skin. If you have under eyes hollowness, even you can use it on your lips to make it plump. Now, here's the thing. Gamit ko siya around, I think, August. Tapos, I stopped using it. Tapos, napansin ko na nasa Hong Kong kami. Sobrang lalim nandito ko. So, hindi siya permanent, girl. So, you have to keep using it. Pero for me, tipid siya. Kasi, you get 50 ml. All you need is this. Ganito lang. Boop. Ganyan lang. Tapos, I also saw many comments that they're like, thank you, Mama Ho, for recommending the Volifilene kasi ginagamit nila before their wedding. And then, nag-plump yung under eyes nila. So, I was like, I love reading comments na effective yung skincare na I recommend. So, itong serum, pansin ko lang, there will be a time in your life you should stop using it kasi magiging plump yung under eyes mo. Pero again, warning, if you stop using it, babalik siya sa dati. So, with consistency is the key for this. You can even mix this with your eye cream, eh. Like, one drop or use it on its own. Okay nang siya. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on to skincare, again, I have to bring this back. This is the best, talaga. This is Good Molecules Discoloration Correcting Serum. If you want even skin tone or alam mo yung maaliwala sing skin mo. You know that people na they just radiant and glowing and they just look brighter. Yung tipo umiilo yung balat kaya morena sila. Gets nyo? Like yung mga tanning skin pero umiilo yung balat. This. Ugh. This is my second bottle. Yung first na ubos. Actually, meron silang jumbo size. Like, a bigger size. Pero hindi ako nakabili kasi bumili ako sa mall. But obviously, available online. I suggest get the jumbo size. Kasi this is one of my fucking holy grails. Kung maubos to, didiretso na ako sa jumbo size. This is so good. Alam mo to the point, I'm like, every time maubos to, I'm just like lucky enough na this is part of my job. Lagi ako naglalambing sa ano, good molly. Kasi baka naman, naubos na yung discoloration ko. Kasi I just love it. Alright, mga girls. So moving on, I have some cleansers dito, yeah babes, we are not done with skincare. It's fucking locked, right? I wanna start off with this one. Hindi pala muna cleanser. We have here a toner. Alam nyo, ang dami ko nabudol dito. Pati mga ano ko, mga friends with benefits ko na boylet, nabudol ko sila dito. Anyways, this is the Nambuzin Toner Super Glowing Essence. Alam nyo, viral to sa ibang bansa. Sobrang sikat na ito. To the point, meron ko Italian na ka-date. Yun the usual kong ano, friends with benefits sa Italian. Can you believe it? Ano na, November na ngayon. We still see each other. Tangin na. Ah, yeah, babe, but I'm staying single. Fuck that shit. Yeah, no. Friends with benefits long, babes. Before I talk about my experience, I want to talk about scientifically why it's the best. Okay. So actually, ito, meron siyang ingredients that Estee Lauder's Advanced Night Repair Serum and yung SK11 have. It's mixed together. Meron sila dito. Like, bifida, yung mga ingredients nila, they just put it here. Na mas affordable price. So if you're going for anti-aging na mala Estee Lauder and SK2, SK11, SK2, 
two, go for this one, the best sugar. girl. Tinag yun, ito yung bawas niya. I had this no, ano pa, June, until now, gamit ko pa rin siya. Five months na, ito na yung bawas niya. Tapos, girl, alam niyo, sober funny, ito na ako, story time ha. Nakita kami ulit ni Italia noong September. If you want fucking proof. Sabi niya pa sa akin one time, sabi niya, what's that skincare you have? Like the numbers. Nakita niya yung CR ko. So yeah, do you still use it? Sabi ko, yeah, you can check the bathroom. Tapos yun, sobrang nagustuhan niya. Bumili daw siya ng ganito, yung number two. Tsaka bumili siya ng mga ibang numbuzzin products. Like, numbuzzin? Bitch, I should be your fucking ambassador. I don't sell online, even in real life. So yun, yung Italian ko na friends and benefits, pag pumunta siya sa bahay, pares kami skincare. Ito din gamit niya, pati pants. Pero alam niyo ha, share ko lang din ha. Usually yung mga nakakasama kong guys, they're very, ano, maalaga sa sarili. Like, they go to the gym, skincare. Wala pa akong na-encounter na, actually, meron ka isa. Isang kadiring, ano, gwapo siya, pero ang baho, putang ina. Yeah, y'all, yeah. Basta pag German, no. No. Like, I had to tell him to brush his teeth first. They exist, babes. Alam nyo, dapat pag may podcast ako soon, I swear, magsa-story time ako, yung moments na ganun. Ang gwapo mo, no, pero kadiri ka pala, no. Tang ina. Mga kamalinis, parang baboy mo, no? Anyway, shut up. Speaking of that, we need to cleanse, babes. Okay? So, I have your cleanser recommendations. Alam nyo, of all cleansers I've tried, I'm sorry. This is the best cleanser of all fucking time. If I'm Kanye, this is Beyonce. She has the best cleanser of all time. This is Nambazin Deep Clean Fresh Cream Cleanser. I'm telling you, this is the most unique cleanser. It's like serum-y, pero when you wash it off, your skin is glowy, sobrang soft. To the point, ha, pumunta kami Hong Kong. Dinala ko to, pero nasa hand carry ko siya. 150 ml siya. So no confiscate. And then I went tried other cleansers. Sakto lang, they're good, but they're not this good. This is my fourth bottle. Actually fifth, honestly. My second bottle was PR. My third binili ko. Ito bumili ako kasi it's just that good. Ako ha, I'm an influencer. I get sent free products. But if I really, really like the product, I will buy. I don't care. I will pay. Because it's that good. So if you guys are looking for the best cleanser, buy the shit. I will not stop raving about this. It's the best cleanser of all time. But if you're traveling, you're going to want to check in. I also put it in. I put it in hand carry. So that's why I confiscate. I'm tired of people in Hong Kong. You know what they're saying to me? It's 150. It's 150. I said, okay, okay. Throw it. Throw it. Okay, throw it. You're so scared. I swear. Comment below if you're going to Hong Kong. People are so fucking mean, y'all. I know who sent sensitive ka, baka iiyak ka dun ba. Just saying, bitch. Alright, so moving on to cleansers. These are like very basic cleansers if I'm looking for something to just wash my face in the morning, not necessarily strip off the dirt. Kasi ito talaga malala talaga to. This is Skintific cleanser. Ang ganda na ito, hindi siya nakaka-dry. So usually I use this in the morning after breakfast kasi I still have like my skincare from last night. But I just wanna feel fresh. Okay siya, hindi siya nakaka-dry. Even if it's a foam cleanser. Tapos, I also like this one. This is Pons Healthy Hydration. Hindi rin siya nakaka-dry. It's a gel. It's a bow. I know it's like fragrance, but it doesn't irritate my skin. So I really enjoyed this one. I also like this one. This is Eye White Facial Wash Whitening Vita. So brang ganda nito. Like I really enjoyed this one too. I know I talked about sunscreen earlier, but I'm back to using this. This is like the perfect sunscreen. At kita niyo naman. Tang ina B, B ano na B? This is the Skin 1004 Hyaluronica Water Fit Sun Serum. You all know I talked about this in previous hauls. I made a review about it. You know it's that good. Pag ganito na itsura niya, it's just that good. And dami ko shopping ayon ha, which I might feature si 1212 na sunscreen. Pero bitch, I keep coming back to this. It's like the perfect consistency. It's not too hydrating to the point na I'm oily skin na medyo mabigat siya na papawisan ako hindi. Pero it's just enough moisture. Especially ngayon, itong Bermans, like parang init lamig, init lamig. Parang weirdo naman itong weather na ito, yung ganun. This is the perfect consistency. Hindi siya ganun kabigat, it leaves my skin dry. Also ha, may confession din ako. Ever since I turned 27, napansin ko ha, is it like normal? Comment below, I don't wanna feel alone. Ever since I turned 27, nahirapan ako mapawisan. Dati, my early 20s, I would say, thank God, take this away from me. It's like a curse, I hate it. Be ngayon, gusto ko na mapawisan be. Kasi ang hirap be, I miss when I was sweaty. Ngayon parang, Papapawisan ako dito lang, dito, dito lang. Dati tagaktak. Be careful nga what you wish for. Like bitch, if you're sweaty, Loki actually is a blessing. Cause I know it's hassle, pero it just feels good that your body is regulating its own temperature. Cause when hindi ka masarap papawisan, pag mainit, you feel like you're gonna faint. So fucking weird. So yon. That's what I realized. Ever since I turned 27, like I swear, Mother Nature grant my wish that hindi masarap papawisan, but it's kind of like a curse too. Where was I again? Okay, going back. So this is the best. 
best sunscreen if you're looking for the perfect consistency na if you have dry skin, oily skin, or if the weather's too cold or it's too hot, it's the perfect balance. All right, so moving on to moisturizer. Lately, I've been going back and forth, either Skintific and Nambazin. This is their daily multivitamin cream. Everything is here na. You don't need other moisturizers. I usually use this at night. Medyo mabigat nga lang siya. So in the morning, I stick with serums and something lightweight. Pero pag gabi, I go for this one. Kasi medyo mas thick siya. So I need all the hydration I can get. All right, mga girls. So moving on, let's talk about makeup. Alam nyo, this theme sa makeup naman, it's more of skin focus. Kasi hindi ako masyado nag-focus sa lips. For me ha, napakadaling magharap ng affordable lipstick that's good. But bitch, pagdating sa foundation, concealers, mga base, ang hirap eh. Like, you know what I mean? Like, para I want someone to tell me which is good or which is not. Like, what should I buy? Especially when it comes to base makeup, they're expensive. A lipstick, you can find it for so cheap. Foundation, if you get it cheap, good luck. You're gonna look like you've got melted. So, I'm gonna give you some base makeup muna. Let's start from there. Tapos, may affordable and then high-end tayo dito. Of course, let's start with the more affordable babes, okay? More affordable vibes. Bitch, why no one's talking about this? This is the Ever Belena Good Skin Day Serum Infused Skin Tint. I did not know there's a skin tint. No, I don't see any marketing. No influencers talking about it. Nakita ko na to sa ano? Sa Shopee. Sa dulo dulo na Shopee. In the fucking dark web of Shopee. You know what I mean? Bitch, no one's talking about it. Pero girl, I'm telling you. Alam nyo, I don't know if it's growing up or if it's just the trend of clean girl aesthetic. Personally for me though, I'm a clean girl. Like, I'm daming millennials na nagsasabi na, oh, Oh my god, put makeup on. I miss the eyeshadow. I miss the old days of YouTube. I miss the fucking cut crease, the smoky eye. You know what, babes? I don't fucking miss it, okay? I love clean girl aesthetic, okay? It's like the bare minimum, but you get the most, okay? I love clean girl aesthetic. I'm gonna be forever a clean girl. If I have to wear eyeshadow, sure I will, but I'm a clean girl aesthetic, okay? So, you're gonna do it. This is in the shade Warm Honey. Usually, so every banana warm honey. Ako. It looks thick, but it blend mo siya. Girl, it's like your skin but better. That's one time, nag FaceTime ako, may kausap ako, you know who, babes. Okay, tas sabi ko, am I wearing makeup or not? Sabi niya, you're not wearing makeup. No, I have makeup. Men are fucking stupid. I don't know if you're wearing makeup or not, okay? This, I swear, ginamit ko rin to sa Hong Kong, nag Disneyland kami. I did not look like I'm wearing makeup. It's so comfortable, tapos parang wala ka lang talaga nalagay, girl. Even sa skin mismo, it looks super natural. I swear, why is no one talking about this? Lately, I'm a skin tint kind of girl, tapos pagdating sa foundation, hindi na ako full coverage. Kasi for me ha, pagdating sa full coverage, they look good in pictures. Pero in person, they look very cakey. No matter how much they market it na, oh, it's like blurring, it's like smoothing. No, they look cakey. For me ha, yung mga light to medium coverage sa foundation, they look more natural. I don't know, maybe I'm not chronically online. I travel now, I talk to people outside social media. I feel like also, it comes with inner work when it comes to foundation. I feel like people who are so stuck and glued on their phone are so used to seeing full coverage that in real life they're like oh why does your skin look like that can we like fucking normalize real skin or babes i don't know touch some fucking grass okay for me i appreciate a person that this doesn't apply for everyone because some people are just like chronically online and have distorted beauty standards in their head you know what i mean for me ha, i really appreciate a person's textures of skin i appreciate a person's freckles or you know they have dark spots which is normal i appreciate it you know i don't don't judge a person just because they have that. You know what I mean? Better yet, touch some fucking grass. For people who are chronically online who judges people based on their looks, touch some fucking grass. That's a whole tangent. Papat ka shabe, no? So moving on, I have another skin tint reco here, which is a bit expensive, but girl, if you want to splurge, treat yourself, gift mo na sa sarili mo for Christmas. I'm telling you, I have TikTok neto. This is the Summer Friday Sheer Skin Tint. This is in the shade number 5. And dami nga nag-comment sa TikTok na yun sabi, hindi siya long-lasting. Bitch! It's so long-lasting. Be, sa Pinas ko pa to gamit ha. Hindi sa Hong Kong. Malamig sa Hong Kong. Sa Pinas ko siya trinay, be. Hindi siya gagalaw. Nanood kami na sine, naglakad kami, tas we went to Manila Bay, dun sa Ferrisville and shit. That area is so fucking hot. I swear ha, sa mga nakapunta ng BOA, yung Manila Bay, hindi ko alam kung mas malapit siya sa equator, pero hayop yan, bakit nakainit doon? Tapos, I was sweating my balls off, pero this, 
skin tint, this will stay on your skin. I don't know why people are saying it's not long lasting. I'm telling you, it's long lasting. If anything, ha, the more you sweat, for me, ha, the better it looks. Because it's more I don't know what people are talking about, babe. <laughs> you know what I mean? All right, so moving on to the next product. This is a BB cushion. But the way I see it, it's a skin tint in a BB cushion form. I'm in the shade Brioche. This is the Chuchu Chu Beauty Yummy Yum Skin Dewy Cushion. My God, I always ako nito. I always get compliments sa skin ko, and I always feel so good. Para sa skin na parang mawala hindi ka makeup. Tapos it's like super quick. You just pat it on your face. I swear, if you hate makeup, you will love this. Ginamit ko to sa concert ni Post Malone. Ginamit ko to sa concert ni Nikki. And shout out to mga curls ko na picture sa akin sa Nikki. Y'all know who you are. Meron ako isang sweet curl. She came up to me na picture siya. Sabi ano gamit mo sa skin mo? I was like, bitch, Chuchu Beauty lang. Every time I wear this, I get so many compliments. This is so good talaga. Nakailang concerts na today. Sa Post Malone dahil pinawisan ako kasi may paapoy si Bayot. Bitch, ang init ng MOA Arena dahil ginawa niyang sauna dahil. Post Malone, sinusumpa ko yun. Pero yun, pinawisan ako but my makeup still look good. If you guys are looking for a good BB cushion, I'm sorry, happy skin. I'm sorry, BLK. Top 1 na to. Alright, Malka. So moving on to foundation. Pagdating sa affordable drugstore foundation, local. I gotta say it, babes. Also about curls, I'm not sure if the review is up, but if it's up, I'll link it down below. This is the Easy Active Foundation. I'm in the shade YT4. I'm wearing it right now. One of the most natural looking foundation. It looks like skin, sobrang gaan. I can write a thesis about it. Like, it's just so fucking good. So moving on the mat, I'm bringing this one back. Okay, this is the NARS Light Reflecting Foundation. I'm in the shade Barcelona. This will give you the most medium coverage foundation. Very natural, because it lasts so long. So I gusto ko to. I have no words. Like, there's a lot of reviews of it. I highly recommend this. Thus, I have two foundation that no one is talking about, but I highly recommend then. First one, this is the Hourglass Ambient Soft Glow Foundation. I'm in the shade, actually, I got 11.5, but it's dark sa akin. And that's why I'm gonna be using yung mga shade adjusters ni Easy and Co. Yung papa light na ng shade yun. For me ha, kung skin tone mo ako, go for 10. Mga ganun, a little bit lighter. Medyo dark siya sa akin. Pero this, bitch. If you're oily skin or pawisin ka, this will stay on your skin for so long. Tapos mukha siyang balat. Parang naka-spotlight yung skin mo. I don't know how to explain it. It just looks so good. Tapos ito, I have here. This is Laura Mercier Foundation. This is in the shade 4N1 Ginger. Alam nyo, no one's talking about this foundation, but this bitch lasts so long. At first, binili ko to, I was like hesitant. Sabi ko, eh, baka MME lang to. Kasi nakikita ko to sa TikTok. Which, here's the Pinas, no one's talking about it. Nakita ko to, tapos sabi ko, hmm, sounds suspicious. You know, yeah. Tapos nung try ko siya, makapal siya. It feels like serumy na parang, basta it feels runny. But let me tell you, when it sets on your face, you know the mask ni Jim Carrey? It feels like it doesn't want to leave your face. And you're the mask. I tried this sa Hong Kong. Extreme rides lahat. It does not come off. Like, bitch. I tried it on a roller coaster. And bitch, my makeup still stayed the same. Naulanan pa kami. Yeah, I don't know what they put on this. Sorcery. Tried this. Actually, binili ko to sa look. PH, pero I'm gonna link it down below. Tinan ko yung sales lady, sabi ko, are you sure ate long lasting siya? It feels weird. Eh, parang ka-ano ko siya, ka-edad ko siya, tapos ang ganda ng kilay niya, makeup niya. Tapos sabi niya, promise ma'am, nag-swimming kami, nag-everything, it still stayed on. Yep, she's right. Ako ka, naulalan ako eh. It stayed on, babe. So, try this, babes. You know who I can see use this? Alam mo yung, like, matured skin? Yun nga, mga early 50s. Kasi, usually, mga foundation nowadays, pagdating sa early 50s, they're very neglected, which I feel bad. Fuck ageism, right? I feel like this is more catered towards yung, especially mga wrinkles dito, ganon. Kasi it does not crease and it lasts so long. And it feels very serum -y. I'm like, oh, yeah, I get it. So, yun. I feel like this is very catered towards mga ano. Alright, so moving on. If we're talking about base, hindi pwede hindi mawala yung concealer. Y'all, she's gonna make a comeback. I'm bringing sexy back, bitch. Hourglass. I have yet to try a better concealer, but Hourglass. This is the best. Fuck. Like, I swear. I'm in the shade, dude. Any circumstances in my life, this will stay on, bitch. Okay? I love this concealer. No wonder it's one of the best. It's viral on TikTok. If you want to splurge and get something for yourself, like a concealer, get this. Just get this, babes. You're welcome. Get this. So moving on, primer. We have, this is the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. Alam nyo, I like this. And for some reason, meron ako yung green, meron ako yung pink. Mas okay yung pink. Hindi ko bet yung green. Weird, weird. As in, hindi siya ganun ka sticky. Try nyo to. Sobrang grabe itong kumapit. Alright, so moving on to blush. I'm excited for this. Kasi I've always wanted to give this a try. Tapos I was like, you know what? Let's treat ourselves, babes. I got it! I fucking got it! 
This is Patrick Toss Double Take Cream and Powder Blush. I got three shades. I know. I have here, this is She's Flush. Ito, this is She's Flush. Tapos, I have here, this is I-T-G-I-R-L. She's That Girl. I have the She's That Girl. Ito siya. Ayan. Tapos, I have here, this is She's Blushing. Ugh, I love this one. So here's my thoughts about Patrick Tuss blushes. Y'all, if you want to splurge, regalo sa sarili nyo, kahit isa lang, Ito yon. A Christmas gift or Christmas wish list. Ilagay niyo na to. I-add to cart na. I'll give you my shade recos. Between the three, ang pinaka gusto ko is She's Blushing. This is the most natural one sa akin. Actually, I'm wearing it right now. It looks like, ano yung ikakasal ka? Ganon. Very fresh lang. I love this one. My hints of brown, so it looks really natural. It's very skin-like. Not brown, nude. But if you're like a pinky girl na natural, I would say go for She's Flush. Ayan, medyo mauve siya na natural. Natural na pink. If you want like more color, like a vibe, go for this. Ito she's that girl. If you're morena and you like the Dior, yung cool tone na blush, yung parang ganon, go for this one. It's very cool tone na pink, pero hindi siya like almost like cartoony na medyo kengkoy. It's still natural, but it gives you this blush of brightness na pink. Go for this. Pero for me, if you're on a budget, ang pinaka 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 sulit. Like you can only afford one. Go for she's blushing. Yeah, it's this. Swear, treat yourself. It's been a crazy 2023. You gotta treat yourself, bitch. I love She's Blushing. It's my favorite. All right, so moving on. Since we're in the topic of blush, I still have more blush recos dito. If we're gonna be talking about blush, we gotta talk about this. This is Get Ready With Me's Milk Tins. I have a review neto, so panawari yun na lang. This is Pablo Latte and Honey Dew. And also, I love Vice Cosmetics Do It All. I have a TikTok neto. I'll link it down below. This is in the shade Always Sweet. Alam nyo yung mga ganitong shades, yung mga nudie nudie, yung mga pale na blush yan. Dati, I would rather die than wear a blush like that. Parang ganito ka pale. Pero my gosh, na-appreciate ko siya ngayon. Kasi it looks very faint, tapos it looks very natural without too much color. Tapos you can layer and layer na hindi siya magmumukhang sinampal ka. Dati, you cannot catch me wearing pale pink blushes or pale blushes. Yung mga maputla-ish, like ganun. No, you will never find me get that. I will always steer towards like dark mauves, yung ganun. But now, na-appreciate ko sila. If you're morena, don't be scared. Try it out. Before you hate it, try it first babes okay but if you're scared pa rin talaga to try yung mga lighter blush this is what i recommend here medyo mahal but if you want to get like a good shade this is like a good shade this is rare beauty in the shade encourage so i really like this shade ayan siya Actually, if you're looking for a dupe neto, get Get Ready With Me Milk Tint in the shade Gelato. Copy ang copy. You know what? I should do a side-by-side -side comparison sa TikTok. Why not, right? Look at my vlog, Gelato. It's the same. I also forgot a shade. This is Vice Cosmetics Do It All in the shade Always Fresh. Ito. More ano naman siya? Nude. Ayan, peachy nude. Compared sa isa very pale pink. Ito more peachy nude. Ang ganda. Like a sun-kissed nude. Alright, so moving on. Let's do setting powders. Y'all, ugh, these are good recommendations. This one, na recommend ko na to two years ago. I'm bringing her back. This is the Huda Beauty setting powder, the best setting powder in the whole world. This is in the shade Blondie. I love this. No words. If you know, you know. If you want the best setting powder that will not make your skin dry, blurred, it will set your makeup the whole day. Get this. Pero alam nyo, I am shocked. Try ko siya side by side. Actually, ito, this is Huda Beauty, and then ito. Drum roll. This is easy weightless loose powder. Exact dupe. I'm telling you, babes. Exact dupe. If you want something more affordable that will give you this effect, Huda Beauty. Exact fucking dupe. Save your money. Get this. So good. It sets my makeup. It doesn't look crunchy. It doesn't look dry. It looks blurred. It looks like skin. Only good things. Tapos, if you want to amp it up and make it more like skin, like I'm wearing it right now. This is the Weightless Loose Powder in the Radiant Finish. Skip highlighter. You don't need it. Ito na yun. Pag naset mo yung face mo, get a fluffy brush. Ganyan mo siya. Tapos, gamitin mo siya as a highlighter. Parang ilagay mo lang siya sa high points ng face mo. My God. It's gonna give you this like very sheer na glowing na skin na hindi siya mukhang crunchy. Na mukhang balat lang. The setting spray mo, mm, voila. Your skin is like naka soft box ka na parang. Wait lang, perfect your lighting yata. Inga dal. Kait get these two. That's all you need, babe. Speaking of highlighter, naman there's one highlighter I really appreciate. This is the Natural Signatura Profile Highlighter. This is in the shade Capis. It's like a champagne color. Yeah, that's what I'm talking. 
brands. Shout out to all the brands, okay? We are tired of blinding highlight. Ito na gusto namin. Gusto namin yung soft glow. Can we make more highlighters like this? Na hindi crunchy, hindi like, yung para alam mo yung para mirror. Ayoko lang ganun eh. I don't like it. Tapos when I see it on person, I'm like, oh, it looks so dirty. You know what I mean? Like, I'm sorry if I sound like I'm judging, but like, ew, it looks ugly. Okay? I'm sorry. It looks fucking ugly. Tapos yung mga chrome na highlighters, I get it. I get the art of it. Yung parang chrome na when you look this way, it looks blue. When you look this way, it looks purple. I get the art of it. Okay, I love art. I appreciate the artistry. Pero for some people that goes to work, some people who just likes to look normal, some people that has a 9 to 5, some people who just gonna go on a date. Do you want that? Come on! Like, I don't wanna sound weird, but like, usually yung mga artistry, they're like reserved on events events, pictures, but for the most part, do people always have events in their life? Maybe they have, but it doesn't require them to wear chrome makeup. You know what I mean? So, ayun nga, going back, can we like create more yung mga soft glow, spotlight glow? Kasi for me, the ultimate luxury, since we're in the topic of quiet luxury, the ultimate luxury is to look like yourself, but an enhanced version of yourself. You know what I mean? Like you didn't even try to look pretty. I feel like that's super luxurious to me. A person who looks radiant and fresh so effortlessly, ang social. For me ha, a person who's not stressed, who gets to travel, who's fresh and effortless, that's luxury. Very quiet luxury. Fuck the designer brands, that's quiet luxury to me. I say who has the time to look effortlessly pretty? People are not stressed, you know? So that's luxury to me, babes. And they're not stressed out to put a shit ton of makeup to look pretty. So moving on, I'm bringing this one back again this is from vice cosmetics this is their midsummer nights lit up tri palette specifically for this bronzer this bronzer is the best bronzer i've ever tried you mga bronzers that i have right now you mga matte i skipped that i love this bronzer this ito, gamit ko ngayon. it's the most natural skin like looking makeup like if you just put it on your face bronzer face it doesn't look like na may nakasalpak sa mukha mo pero your skin is so defined ang hirap explain pero it's just beautiful so if you guys are planning to get this get this meron silang contour shade yung malaki no skip those latte coco i don't i can't remember get this vice create like a bigger shade for this and don't discontinue this this is my favorite like i swear this bronzer gives you that very beautiful pang mayaman na skin trust me so moving on to blush the man if you want affordable this is so good i don't see a lot of people hyping this up but i'm giving where credit is due this is the best blush i've ever tried the local this is color bounce in mochi this is like a bird sienna of all the shades tinay ko lahat sa colorette ito yung pinaka gusto ko very jelly like tapos it turns into powder ayun siya ang ganda tapos what i like about this blush whether nagset ka na ng foundation or your skin is wet from the foundation it still works well minsan may times kasi pag nagme makeup ako na set ko na yung makeup ko na putang ina shit wait lang kailangan ko ng cream blush i forgot girl no need no need to worry just dip your brush ganyan mo na shots ganyan mo lang voila okay siya on top of powder minsan nga i put this underneath when my foundation is not set tapos pag naka set na siya ilalagay ko siya ulit ah oh, i love this and it lasts so long get this shade. This is in Mochi. This is the best one. Lahat ng shades, mm, sakta lang. Get this. Alright, Malka. So before we move on to the next product, when it comes to makeup, of course, I have to talk about this. This is the Happy Skin Marge Brushes, y'all. I have to put it here because it's so lambot neto. Whatever this is, it's a hanger dito. Ihang mo lang siya. I swear, I'm lambot neto. That's the brushes. So good. My favorite brush dito is this brush. Pang set ng under eyes and powder. Tapos ito, favorite ko din to. This is like for foundations and base makeup. Yan. So if you're looking for a good brush, get this brush collection at Happy Skin March. And congratulations, my sis! Alright, mga curls. So for makeup naman, pagdating sa setting spray, these are my two top favorite setting spray talaga. Like, swear, get them. The first one, this is Power Magnet Setting Spray from I'm Meme. This one, I really love it. Sober liit niya, tapos ang bango. Don't get me wrong, I still love my Dazzle Me. Again, the only complaints I have kay Dazzle Me is yung packaging niya. So I really hate it sa makeup bag ko kasi it's like bright green. This is the solution. Like the packaging is so nice. Tapos yung spray niya, tinan nyo. Hindi siya katulad sa Dazzle Me na psh, 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 
it's more mist. So I really like this. Ang downside lang nito compared kay Dazzle Me. It's more expensive. I get it. But the packaging, the effects, you miss niya. Good quality siya. And it's very small compared to Dazzle Me. Na ganyan kalaki. Pag nagka travel ako, I prefer bringing this. Kasi maliit lang siya. And then second is Strokes Beauty Skin Veil Cooling Mist. Again, I'm bringing her back. Perfect siya pang outdoor kasi malamig siya. So hindi ka masyadong mapapawisan. You feel cooler, mas malamig, and it makes your makeup last so long. Alright, so moving on to lip Lips naman mga curls. My theme pagdating sa lips is all about red. Cause like Christmas is coming up. We all love the nudes. We all love the MLBBs. But can we just bring red back? Holiday red, Taylor Swift red, Marilyn Monroe red. I love red lipstick. Lately, that's my addiction. I love red, okay? I don't know, it just gives you this effortless, put together look. Na mo ka naka full face of makeup, which you're not. I know, there's a magic sa red, okay? Tapos, when I was traveling lately, every time pag nasa airport kami, madadaanan ko yung mga ano, Fly Emirates na stewardess. Yun yun, they're just like changing flights, I don't know. They always have this red lipstick. Tas tinitigan ko sila, sabi ko, wow, they're so pretty. Like, wow. Red lips, no? Red lips. It just has a different effect, I swear. I have here mga lip balms and lip oil. First off, this is Summer Friday's lip balm. They're expensive, I know, very expensive, but my God, if you want to treat yourself, get it. This is in the shade Vanilla. This is clear lang, pero ang yummy na ito. Sobrang bango. Tapos, this is Cherry. It's like a tint of red. I really love this. Lagi silang sold out. I'll link kung saan ako bumili nito. Bumili ako nung Christmas set nila. May iced coffee pa yun yung nude. Pero binigay ko kay Kat. Kasi, as in, amoy coffee siya. Which, I don't know. It's kind of off-putting for me. Kasi nagugutom ako. And it's nude. It's nice. So, yun. I really like this one, Summer Fridays. Tapos, lip oil. This is Everbilena Serum Tinted Lip Oil. Meron silang ibang shade that I would recommend. I'll just put a picture nito. I forgot the name. Glass Slipper ba yun? Basta yun. Nasa bag ko eh. Tapos nawala. Oh my god. Like, comment below. Can you relate? Like, you switch bags and then you don't know where your shit is. Yeah, me. My life. Actually, this is glass slippers. This is their color changing lip oil. Sobrang ganda nito. Tried the other shades, the nude ones. So good. It was in my bag, I promise. But I lost it. The other lip products I would recommend this is Caroline Tinted Mint Bomb. Girl, I attended their event for this and I got this for free. This is in the shade Wonderland. Y'all, wait, let me actually wear it for you. Chaka alam yung mga curls, sobrang weird. Lately, I don't know, maybe it's because I'm growing up and I know stuff like that. Are you? You know, your taste change, or maybe it's because of the clean girl aesthetic. Lately, I love tinted lip balm. Skin tint, tinted lip balms is my jam, you know? So, this is Caroline. This is in the shade Wonderland. Girl, it looks dark, ganyan siya. Pag nilagay mo sa lips mo, it gives you this like flush na color, like a very berry na. Girl! Oh, tapos, you know what's so nice? Sobrang lamig niya sa lips. Kaya, what I appreciate, it's moisturizing, it's cooling sa lips. Kasi some people, pag nagli-lip balm, which is, I'm people, pag nagli-lip balm, alam mo yung pinapawisan yung dito mo kasi mainit. You know what I mean? Oh my God. This one, no. Magaan siya, malamig siya. Tapos, it just looks so fucking good. I'm definitely putting this in my travel bag. So good. Alright, so moving on to the next lip product. You guys are gonna be shocked with this one. At eh, matatawa kayo. This is my skincare lip balm. Pag kanya, when I do my skincare, I put this lip balm. This is Vaseline Lip Care in Kissing Red. I know, you're like, Vaseline? What the fuck? I keep seeing influencers promote this, not sponsored post. Tapos, nakataon, I worked with Shopee for a sponsored post. Tapos, they sent me some products. Nakataon, this was in there. So, sabi ko, sige, Nga, nga natin to. Bitch, I don't know. Pag maubos to, I'm buying a new one. Bitch, look at this. Alam mo po, like, sa skincare ka, at night, maybe kasama mo jowa mo. Or, you know, you just wanna look cute, you know, in traveling or going to bed. Kasi minsan, pag wala ka makeup, di ba parang, yeah, your skin is glowy, pero parang ang putla mo tignan. But you wanna go to bed hot? Ito yun, babe. Wait lang. Tira yun, sobrang bogus niya kasi sobrang gusto ko siya. Like, look at this. Ang gawin on. Instantly. It gives you this pink lips. Ayun, no? I know, right? Tas ang bango niya, amoy honey. Oh, smells so fucking good. Yan siya. Tas in person, you know what it looks like? It looks like, alam mo nagpa-lip tattoo ka? Alam mo yung mga lips na mga afam? Yung pink na? Yung mga European, yung mga lips nila parang pink? It looks like that, babe. So, Vaseline, 
If there was one person to sponsor, bitch, that was me! This one, you'd get it. I was like, what the fuck? Ang ganda. Especially if you have dark lips. Ito yung result niya. Tapos, you know what's so funny? I keep getting comments sa Instagram stories. Mga mga didiyam sa akin. Mama Ho, paano mo napapula yung lips mo dati? Dark yan. Girl, I'm wearing this. <laughs> Hindi ko na siya sinasabi sa Instagram story kasi I was waiting for this day, bitch. Ito yun. Nakalip mama ko, be. See, it looks so natural. Na kayo din, you were like, wait, how did you make your lips pink? Tutorial how to do My lips are just the same. Nakalip bum lang ako, be. Tapos, Min said, to amp it up, lalagyan ko siya ng Summer Fridays. Yan, I'm just gonna squeeze a little bit. Para mas juicy. Ugh! I love makeup! Okay, so this one, this is in Kissing Red. Yeah, I'll get this one. Those influencers were not doing a good job, babes. Okay, shut up. All right, so moving on, one of my favorite lipsticks. This is from Izzy. This is Opus. If you're looking for a more natural, pero with color, get this. Like, sobrang favorite ko to. Tinan mo, paubos na nga siya eh. Be, ito na nga ha. Naglaplapan kami ng Brazilian kong guy. Lahat-lahat na hindi siya natatanggal. Tapos pag nag-gym ako, minsan suot ko to, hindi siya natatanggal. It's like red, pero... It's like berry. Ano siya? Natural. Diba? It's very natural. This is like my perfect, ano, on-the-go lipstick where I want color on my face. Ito yun. Opus. Ang ganda. So moving on, I have here, this is a new one. This is from L'Oreal. This is their matte resistance in the shade Le Rouge Paris. Because I saw Kendall Jenner wear it and it's like a cute red. So ito siya. Sobrang gandang red. Ayun, a very holiday red. I want to wear it sa lips ko ngayon, pero may lakad ako, so mahirap siya tanggalin. It lasts so long. So if you're the type of person you like red lipstick, pero yun nga, kakain kayo, tapos ayaw mo mag-retouch, babes, get this. Tapos comparing to Maybelline Super Matte Ink, hindi siya ganun ka-dry, tapos hindi siya ganun ka-crunchy. Mas manipis siya, be. So get this one. This is L'Oreal. Tapos, I feel like, yun nga, red lipstick, obviously, it's the holidays. Ang dami for sure mag-red lipstick. Wait, I have to put lipstick. Alam nyo, the amount of messages, DMs, comments about my lipstick no nag Marilyn Monroe ako for Halloween. I'm shook! Ang dami nagtatanong. Even in person, I remember this was an event sa Good Molecules. May nagtanong sa akin, ano red lipstick mo? Girl, this is Get Ready With Me main character. Tinan nyo naman, sobrang durog na. Kasi girl, gamit na gamit siya. This is the perfect cool tone red. If you're looking for a red lipstick na bullet ha, hindi yung liquid lipstick, get this one. This is the perfect Sexy, vintagey, na ang hina pa explain it. It's like very seductive na red. You know what's so funny? They call this main character. Tas meron silang shade femme fatale na red. Babes, no, this is the femme fatale, babes. Yeah, she's the femme fatale. There's also this magic power whenever you wear red on a date. They just fall in love with you, babes. Here's a tip: try wearing red lipstick on a date. I swear, it's over for them, babes. Yeah, wear red lipstick. Men are simple, dumb creatures. Just wear red lipstick. They're gonna be fucking obsessed, babes. Okay. Tapos, this one is the lip liner, new classic. This bitch does not move. I'm telling you, hindi siya gagalaw. Ayun nga, gamit ko nga siya sa ano, yung nag Marilyn Monroe kami, nag-photoshoot kami whole day yun, tapos nagbili ako merienda. Last trip pa ha, di ba sa mga photoshoot, I usually buy food for mga photographers, mga people in the, yung mga staff, I always buy food. Kailangan lahat kami busog. Sabi ko, ano gusto yung kainin? Sabi nila, huwag na pizza, umay na kami, kasi usually pizza pinapakain sa kanila. And I was like, okay. Tapos gusto nila pansit, be! Like, Amber's kami. So my barbecue pancet conchinta. Tapos ito yung lipstick ko. Bitch, I'm telling you, hindi siya gumalaw kay kung ano ano pancet barbecue conchinta. This lipstick stayed on. So yon. This lip liner is that bitch. Hindi siya magbebleed. So I love it. That time nung Marilyn Monroe ako, wala pa to. Hindi pa siya release. Na early October ako ng photo shoot, so hindi pa siya available itong L'Oreal. Alright, Malker. So we have fragrance here. Actually, the lip balm lang ako. Ito yung gamit ko. So good. Oh wait. By the way, I almost forgot the name. Balik tayo sa makeup, real quick. I'm sorry. This one I have here. This is the only eyeshadow recommendation I would give. Ha. This is Judy Doll in the shade G02. Ayan siya yan. Sobrang mura niya. This is an exact dupe ng Urban Decay. Tinan nyo. Ayan siya. And also, ano, exact dupe ng Fenty Diamond Bomb look. When you put it on, ayan siya. It's just like wet glitter. I love Chinese makeup, okay? Chinese makeup, doyin makeup, knows what's up. It's like sparkles lang. And it looks wet. I love it. Yeah, anyway, shut up! So, yan. So, that's what it looks like. Ito siya. I'm gonna swatch it on my hand. Ito sobrang mura niya lang. Ayan siya. So pretty! Oh my god, look at that! It just looks wet. 
I swear. Judy doll is the vibe. No, 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 this is End Honey. This is their Melty Moist Repair Treatment. I tried the deep conditioning in dark yellow. Babes, this is better. Yung pang repair na hair. My hair is so damaged, but it looks so healthy. Tas ang bango neto. I got so many compliments ang bango ng hair ko. Si Kat, she told me my hair smells so good, and I smell so good, and my hair smells good. Nung sa Hong Kong kami, actually, babe, dala ko pa sa Hong Kong. Ang last trip pa. Like comment below, please tell me I'm not alone. Hindi ko siya nilagay sa travel size na bottle. Bango ito din nila ko to. Nilagay ko sa Shein na ano, Ziploc, para hindi siya mag-leak. Buong ito dahi! So, yun. Tapos, again, I have to bring this back. This is my second bottle. Yan, naubos yung first one. This is the End Honey Deep Moist Hair Oil. It's instant rebond for my hair. Yeah, my hair is bleached, but it looks healthy. First time in my life. For the shampoo and conditioner, go for Melty. For me, ha? Pag damage yung hair mo, like heat damage, go for that. Pero sa oil, mas bet ko yung Deep Moist. Kasi meron ako yung Melty na oil, hindi mm, masyado. Hindi siya ganun ka, parang silk na nunot sa hair. No, it's just like, okay lang. I prefer this. Very quick lang sa hair kasi I just have to bring it back because it's one of the best products I've tried this year so far that healed my hair. Oh, by the way, last na. You all know I love Fino, yung hair treatment. Tapos, they came out with an oil. So, kailangan mong gawin, pagka-scoop mo ng ano, Fino, lagyan mo siya ng oil, ganyan mo, tapos ilagyan mo sa hair mo. And let me tell you, ito yung result. Yeah! Look at that! Just so you know, my hair is bleached. Bottle bleached. But for me, ha, I'll be honest, if you're on a budget, you don't need to buy this. But if you want to try, go ahead. Okay na to. This is enough. Kahit i-mix mo na nga to sa Fino, trinay ko din. Okay siya. Alright, mga girls. So, moving on to fragrances. There are two items here that I'm gonna bring back, ha? Kasi I just... Mm. They have to come back. They need to have a comeback. They need to have a fucking comeback. If you guys are wondering if I'm still using pheromones, yeah, bitch! Pheromones! I swear, I know I am all about decentering men, but I swear, men loves this shit, okay? Proven and tested. I have many story times about this fucking pheromone making my life amazing. This one time, Sotko pheromones, chaka mod vanilla ni Ariana Grande. When we met the Brazilian, he asked me, number one, what perfume are you wearing? I'm like, oh, I'm not wearing perfume. Yeah, I don't tell him I'm wearing perfume because I'm hot. Trust me, and have reviews in Shopee that, Mama, how many buy this? One of my best discoveries this year. So it has to have a comeback, this 11-11. So moving on, again, this needs to have a fucking comeback, y'all. This needs to have a fucking comeback. Okay, for just 90 pesos or 100 pesos, your private parts will smell like flowers. Okay. Alam nyo, I've tried everything. I've tried the rose. Lahat ng variants trinay ko kasi I was bored. Yeah, this is the best one. This is flower in the variant cherry blossom. Ito, 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 ito. Ayan. Cherry blossom or sakura. This is the best one. Ito yung pinakababango. May nagsabi nga rose, mabango daw. Trinay ko, hindi din ba? Ah, may panlinis ng CR for me ha. In case if you guys are questioning to buy this, I mean, it's just 90 pesos. But, 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 I got a DM, ito ha. I'm gonna cover the name, but I really appreciate the DM. Ng sinabi niya yon. I was like, oh, same. And I also have my own story time since like share siya, mo share na rin ako. If you're new here, meron ako ano kahok up na Brazilian. Actually, he's my favorite. No, I ano, know. He's doing the thing. He said, I ano, I smell so clean. So I was like, yeah, I know. Down there, it smells like flowers. <laughs> It doesn't smell like human anatomy. It smells like flowers. So this one's super worth it. Yeah, it's just for 90 pesos. Just like put on thing drops lang. You can actually use this as a cologne. But for me, I use it on special occasions. All right, moving on to fragrances naman. I swear, this is one of my favorite discovery. This is actually Bath & Body Works. This is an Eau de Parfum. Binili ko to sa MOA. Kung malapit ka sa MOA Asia, get it. Pero wala akong nakita ang Eau de Parfum neto sa Shopee. Pero they have a mist version. Dream Bright na variant. Men have Dior Sauvage. Men have Chanel Blue. Bitch, if you wanna smell like a red flag, yung ikaw mismo yung mag-gaslight sa lalaki. Ikaw yung prize and alam mo yun, ikaw yung fuck girl. <laughs> ikaw yung babaeng version of fuck boy. Bitch, ito yun. The perfect femme fatale. You're Amy Dunn, you know what I mean? You're that bitch. You're that it girl. I swear. Dream bright. I'm so passionate about this. If you want to smell like a red flag, yung tipong men are scared of you, yet they want to try you out because you're toxic. Just like us. Alam naman natin, toxic 
cute yung lalaki, pero oto-oto naman tayo. Kasi namoy natin yung Dior Sauvage, di ba? Bitch, ito yon. This is dream night. I'll try my best to find a legit na link ng Eau de Parfum, but maraming miss neto. This is a new version. This came out last year, if I'm not mistaken, no holiday. Girl, the perfect berry, musky, na sexy, na dark feminine. Sobrang dark ng amoy niya na parang, I would say Medusa vibes. Hindi pong sobrang ganda mo, pero you're gonna turn them into fucking stone. This, Ginamit ko pa nga to sa gym eh. Ang bago, kahit mapawisan ba eh. So moving on, actually I usually test mga fragrance pag nag-gym ako. Pinapawisan talaga ako pag nag-treadmill ako. So I usually smell it pag nahaluan ang pawis ko. So ganun ako mag-test. So you know it's legit. I also recommend this. This is Ariana Grande Cloud Pink. Alam nyo, versus Cloud, Cloud Pink, sobrang bango na ito. Sobrang long-lasting. Si Cloud kasi medyo gourmand na ambery. Ang hirap explain eh. It smells medyo nakakalala kahilo pag nainitan. But this bitch, pag nainitan to, apakabango. Sobrang fruity. Take cloud na medyo cloying sa ilong, but make it lighter. It's like a clean version ni cloud. Sobrang bango na ito. Tapos ang long lasting pa. Tapos parang ewan ko, it just makes me feel so good if I smell this. I swear. Dati gusto ko si cloud no 2020. I was young, you know, I like the smell. Pero this smells younger, babes. Like, it smells more it, girl. I love this. This is so good. Cloud paint, get this. Tapos I have some Victoria's Secret here naman. So if you're looking for a dupe ni Ariana Grande REM na mas more sweeter, more vanilla-ish. Get this. This is Victoria's Secret Lavender Vanilla Relax. Fuck! Sobrang bango na ito. Tapos sobrang long-lasting niya. Ginamit ko sa siya gym. Nag-gym ako from 7 a.m. 9.30 natapos ako. Tapos naglakad pa ako pa uwi. Ang init doon. Tinik yung araw. I can still smell this! Sobrang bango. Tapos parang hindi siya nahaluan ng pawis. It just smells the same. Ito. Ugh! So good. The second, this one, this is Victoria's Secret Tea's Cream Cloud. This is one of the gourmand scents that I would forgive. Na kahit mainitan siya, it doesn't smell bad. It smells so creamy, like coconut. It's super long-lasting. Ito yung ginamit kasi nag-ocean park kami sa Hong Kong. Nag-rides kami, naulanan ako. I can still smell it on me. Actually, I'm wearing it right now. Sobrang bango. Sobrang gourmand na very fresh na cozy, cashmere. It smells like a warm hug. Yeah, that's the best way I can describe it. It smells like a hug. Sobrang comforting na amoy niya. Try this. This is Cream Cloud. I got the travel size, pero yung travel size niya, in fairness, ha, 75 ml. Ang dami na ito. Sa liit. Tapos plastic. So, hindi siya mababasag. Alright, so moving on to the last fragrance, y'all. This is one of my favorites. Sabi daw nila, this is a dupe ni Mod Vanilla. Actually, for me, honestly, I'll have to disagree. I'll stick with my Mod Vanilla imitation. Yun, copy ang copy si Mod. Pero ito, this is the Bath & Body Works Cozy Vanilla Bourbon. This smells like Mod Vanilla. Na hinaluan siya ng Bare Vanilla ni Victoria's Secret. It's the perfect mixture. Sobrang bow niya. Oh! It's warm bourbon, dark fruit, and vanilla liquor. Imagine mod vanilla na mas vanilla, you know, more seductive. You know what I mean? It's like mod vanilla's dark sister. Yeah. It smells a little bit like alcoholic liquor, pero pag nag-dry down siya, medyo mas vanilla na siya na fresh na musky. Ah! Sobrang bango! I'm telling you, bitch. Uh, imagine mod vanilla na nahaluan ng bare vanilla. That's the perfect way I can describe it. All right, Malcro, so that concludes this vlog of our 11-11 haul. What do you guys think? Like, which of the products are you most likely going to get for yourself as a Christmas gift? Pang regalo sa friend, family, joa ko meron. Yeah, I still hate men, pero I still believe in love, okay? I'm just careful. So I'm still supportive of pang regalo sa joa or regalo sa sarili, most of all. Kailangan self-love pa din. And of course, Mal Curls, I hope you found this video interesting and helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Below. And of course, small curls. Very important is to stay with your cap. Mamaba. How's it keep? Bye guys!